Hello everybody and welcome back to the new safe hour. Jumping in once again, we're on a four streak here. I think I'm going to go as the good old Little Forgotten. We are using a new mod now. We are using a mod called Milkshake. It's only a mod in beta, it's not fully out yet, but uh, I've been following it for a little while on the Discord um, and seeing how it's coming along. And it's at a point where it's playable now and I've been requested to try it out. So I want to give it a little go and see how we uh, see how we feel about it and hopefully have a good time seeing some new items. I think there's around 20 or so new items, new trinkets, uh, new consumables, stuff like that. Uh, I, th I think potentially some new enemies as well. There's quite a lot in this mod. Um, and yeah, I'm excited to see what is on offer. I'm excited to see what we can see. But yeah, it's been a little while since I played Isaac, actually. Um, just because I, uh, I've i had family over for a few days, so I backlogged recordings for like four or five days. And then um, from there, I've just not really been playing since then, so... I'm a little bit behind, and my skills may be a little bit waning. Leave a little bit, bit, little bit to be desired, but we'll we'll see how it goes. And by a little bit to be desired, that's what I mean right there. Just getting hit straight away, but we'll see what our first item room holds for us. We get um, doggy bag, which there you go. Look, straight off the bat, we get a new item. Taking damage spawns a random poop. Isaac can pick up poops by walking into them. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, cool. It's got like a little. Uh, a little thing behind you to tell you what poop you're going to get. I like that. Okay, these enemies, very annoying for the Forgotten. I realize I could just not swipe at them, but I will never. I will never not swipe. Oh, for God's sake. Um, I seem to have... Okay, there you go. I picked up that poop. I see. I see. That's pretty cool. So, can I re-pick up this poop? Yes, I can. And can I carry that through rooms? Yes, I can. Okay, I like this item. This item's pretty cool. This item's pretty cool. I like the way it gives you an indication of what poop you're about to get as well. That's a really nice addition to this. Ah <laughs> Get shit on, boy. Okay, what have I done to myself here? I have uh, put myself into a bad position. A very bad position. Okay, it does seem like it, it can only trigger once per room, though, which is fair enough. Not great on my behalf, then. Not great on my behalf. We've also not got a key for uh, going mother here, which is where I did want to go. But hey ho, let's let's continue on and try and not uh, try and not lose everything. We've got a golden poop coming in next. I like that a lot. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully I can get a, a burn heart back here. Addicted is whatever. It's whatever. There's a key. I'm gonna go straight for the uh, library here, even though I do want to do mother. I want a book to help me out, to save me from this purgatory. Doubles all trinket spawns, converts trinkets into gold versions. We'll do that to make our trinket gold, and we'll take this, which gives us a tech item for the floor, I believe. Well, inside. Oh no, wait, what, what is this? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Gain a bomb and gives a bomb synergy for the rest of the floor. Okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. It's kind of like a, a lesser version of the Bombonomicon, which I can get behind. Oh man, I am playing so bad right now. This is the thing with the Forgotten. I, I play him too aggressively. Gets me hurt a lot. Hey, there's a heart at least. Oh, I've got welting, whatever it's called. Smelted. I don't want that smelted. I want the heart. Oh, dude, no. I need the hearts. <laughs> it's turning them all Apple of Sodom. That's what it's called. Oh man. Okay, so I might just end up dying on this run. I might just end up dying on this run. Let's uh, go into soul form for a hot minute before I uh, perish. Man. You can tell it's been a little while since I played Isaac, can't you? You can tell it's been a little while. I like the way the book gives you a bomb on use as well. Right. Use spectral to our advantage here. Don't do anything stupid. Or too stupid, at least. This feels like it's going to be a rough fight. Welling Sack plus Bobby Bombs seems like the way to go here. I was really, really hoping this would be, um, this would be HP, but I guess not. I could go in here, but this seems like a really, really, really bad idea, but I'm going to do it anyways. Ooh, it was not a bad idea, or potentially not a bad idea. Okay, so far, it was still a bad idea. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. It's all, it's all worked out fine. It's all worked out fine. Right. Try and get a key. Try and get a heart as well. I'm very annoyed that we've got a smelted version of the Apple of Sodom. As this character, that seems brutally difficult to have. 
as part of our uh, part of our setup here. Uh, secret room might allow us to get into our item room. Um, I'm thinking it's here. It's not. No way. That's very, very frustrating to find out. Okay, so I'm not even going to get into my item room so far. This is not good. Not good at all. Oh, God. Don't like the prospects of this room. <laughs> That's just a penny. This is... This is a bit racist. It's a bit racist. I don't get anything I want. I don't know how to feel about that. Right. Um, try and get a heart out of these, please. Go in here and... I didn't realize there was dips there. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll... That was a fun item to get, but we're doing a hot restart here. Um, sinus infection is very good off the bat here. Would have liked to have uh, played around with that milkshake item a little more, but I am unable to play this game to a even basic standard. And yeah, Apple of Sodom, it's good when you got hearts, but otherwise, it's horrible. It got me killed, basically. I mean, I got me killed, but I'm going to blame something else, because I don't, I don't want to be at fault here, and I don't think you should want me to be at fault either. Right, the two item rooms we get, Ghost Bombs is not bad at all. I do liketh the Ghost Bombs. Um, I think I can just bomb this to use it once. There you go, beautiful. Let's get rid of the fires first. We'll pop this open as well. Range is very good for us here, I'm happy with that. Oh, my god, why am I like this? It's okay, though. We got a rainbow poop to make me happy. Oh, and we get flight as well. Lovely bit of transcendence here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, now. Now I'm feeling better about this. I kind of... I'm, I'm, I'm okay with the with the reset. I knew it was going to happen, though. I haven't played Isaac in a while, so I knew it was going to be problematic for me when I did. It always is. If I take a few days break, I just lose any ability to know how to play the game. It's It's quite sad, really. Where can we use our cracked key here, do you think? So far, we're not finding any areas of which the cracked key is usable. Right. But yeah, having flight now makes it so we can get the advantages of the ghost without being tethered, without being chained down. I like that a lot. Oh god. Bad hit there. Got a double boss is coming up. That was close. That was close. Where are we going to use this cracked key? There's literally no indications of anywhere that I can use it right now. Which seems odd. No hearts from you? Okay. Get ourselves a slick penny there. I guess we'll just go. Um, I, should, I should grab that heart just in case. It might apple a sodom, but we'll see. It didn't. How's that? Okay, there's a thingy here. I doubt this will be it, but I'm just going to try it anyways. Yeah, I, I didn't think this would be it, but... I gave it a go. Okay. Squared up. Good amount of keys. We can do mother this time around. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. And we'll uh, keep on keeping on. Got a button there. I thought I might as well press it just in case. I, I, I tend to have pretty good luck with buttons overall, so I thought why not try it out. But this time, unfortunately not what we we're looking for. Right. This guy, not too bad. We've got ghost bombs as well. Ghost v ghost. I'm excited for that fight. Go. Nice and easy kill against this guy. Ooh, we get a very, very, very good item out of that as well. Do 50% more damage to bosses that have over 150 health, which is basically all of them late game. Even some of the early game ones like this guy, I'm pretty sure. Some extra money, lovely. Quite a lot of extra money. Check in here. And we'll take this some extra damage. Uh, quickly go and check out our shop, uh, just because we have the keys and now quite a bit of money. I could use a bomb to get in there, but I think keys is better to use right now, considering we're going to need bombs to get through our door. Oh, we, we don't need to because it's unlocked. I forgot about that. Um, I'll take the puffle stool, whatever it's called. Puff stool, yeah. 
Puff Stall's pretty good. Two room charge ability to stun most of the room, especially with the ability to like fly over. I love the way we just have no body as this guy. <laughs> it looks so funny. But yeah, um, ability to like fly over stuff makes this really, really good. Um, because we can just kind of put it down and then like hover around the area, try and find our little way in and get some easy, cheap kills, which I always like. Easy and cheap is, is the way that I play things. Oh god, I didn't realize that guy spawned things. My bad. Okay, not too bad. That was a pretty bad hit though from me. Pretty bad hit. The mustard seed, I guess I'll take. Uh, I think I would have probably preferred the Lowres bottle, whatever it's called, but Mustard Seed is pretty good, especially if it does work with our setup, which I think it will. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, cool. Oh, Mustard Seed also gave us a HP up. Okay, so Mustard Seed was the right choice. I didn't realize it was giving us a HP up. I was like, when did I heal that half heart? Wait a minute. When did I have three burn hearts? <laughs> yeah, like, look at that. These guys... They got nothing on me. They have no idea what's going on. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I was hoping for a worm trinket there, because they can sometimes add range and stuff, but it is what it is. Crack that open. Get ourselves out. Oh, no cracked key this time. Sad times. Sad times. It's okay, though. Oh, we've got another one right here. Dude, these rocks are common, man. Especially in areas where there's a lot of spiked rocks. But I do like them, though. It's a fun way to introduce more uh, red rooms to the game, which I think is always interesting. Always at least interesting. Okay, I don't want to use the stool here. It's not worth it. Grab that. Use it here, because these enemies can be a bit annoying. Throw there wasn't particularly good. I'm getting, like, no indications of red rooms, like, anywhere at the moment. I mean, this probably means that this is secret room, right? But I do need to save two other bombs after this. I can't use any more. A D4. I don't think I want the D4, thank you. Don't think I want the D4. I think that would be a bad choice for me. Hey, Mustard Seed did proc there. Good to good to see that happen. Good to see that happen. Right. Trying to get a little bit more money here. I should probably just take in Petrified Poop there, but eh. Ooh, hello. Probably should have taken that at the end of the floor there, but it's okay. Oh, wait, that did, like, the Toadstool thing did, like, a ton of damage to him there. What happened there? I'm not entirely sure how that works. But I'm happy about it, definitely. Hey, here's another item. Uh, immune to stomping attacks. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, I'll check inside here, but there's likely not going to be anything I want. Slick Spade is very good. Um, swung and thrown clubs can apply the tier effects. Okay, I'll take it. Considering it actually told me that, I'm pretty happy about that. Right. Let's bomb this. Bomb this two times. It's a little risky to take that, but I do very much like Slick Spade. And the fact that it explicitly tells me that it does work with this character makes me like it even more. Good, just a pill. Crack key here. Didn't reward us with what we wanted, but oh well. You guys love each other. Excuse me. That was a little rude. Hey, beautiful. Another burn heart. Although, yet again, getting screwed over by having the bloody thingy smelted onto us. I really don't like that. I need to change the settings on that because very annoying to just lose out on HP that I should be getting. Like that. Dude. Why? <laughs> Why you do this to me? Right, item room. Have we seen? Yeah, we have seen item room, of course. Okay, so go back to our white fire and get this done. We're actually one penny off the shop as well here, so let's just quickly check that out. Hey, actually, let's pick that one up. Good, good, good. Right. Quickly check out the shop here. Um, Unfortunately, two active items. Both very, very good active items. In fact, I think that we'll probably take Mr. Me and be pretty happy with it. Um, And then we'll fire up and go and finish off this floor. Where's that mirror room at? Okay, there it is. Okay, so we've actually only got one combat room to, to go through to get our, um, to get to our item room, which is very, very nice. I can get these, technically, but it's a little, a little sussy, a little spicy. I'd rather not. 
Okay, these guys can obviously be really annoying when we're in this forgotten mode. This, uh, sorry, lost mode, not forgotten mode. Okay, not too bad at all. Bunch of extra money. And then we'll just grab that and then we'll go straight back out again. I'm not bothering with the boss or trying to get other stuff from other rooms. I'm pretty, pretty happy and set with what I've got going on right now. I'm not going to try and mess with that. Right, out we go. And away we go. We did get, we've got the empty vessel heart going on, whatever it's called. Um, the abyss heart, which means we will get a red locust. I think it's a random one. I don't know if it's specifically a red one. We'll get a locust at the end of this floor. Well, at the start of the next floor, more, more so, should I say? Um, hello. Uh, but yeah, so that, that's going to be quite nice. We can keep that alive for a little longer. That'll be great. But I imagine we're probably going to lose it this floor. But yeah, we get a little, yeah, little, little red dude. Got a little bleedy boy. Oh, hello. We've, we've only got one bomb currently, so this doesn't do anything for us right now. But um, if we get more bombs, we can bomb the hell out of that. I think Mr. Me will, will act as a bomb. We should probably try that out, actually. Let me go and try that out, see if Mr. Me acts as a bomb. I think he does if you just aim a rock. I think he just goes and explodes. Oh, no. No, he doesn't. Oh, it's because there's an enemy in the room. Fuck's sake. He, uh, I, I really, really hope there's, there's a mod that comes out at some point that stops um, charmed enemies still counting as enemies. Because there's a lot of things that still target them, and it's very frustrating. Yeah, the, the fool's gold thing isn't a priority right now. So we're likely to just get, like, Midas Touch out of it. When I say that, and as I say that, Midas Touch appears. Ah, I lost my empty vessel heart. Oh, no, I didn't. Not, not yet. Not yet, I didn't. Now I did, though. Man. Apple of Sodom. You ruin everything, right? Okay, so we got enough bombs to bomb this now, though, and see what we get. But we've already got Midas Touch, which is good, because that means we should get something else. Oh, dude, this thing gives you a lot of money. Holy shit. Wow, okay, this thing's insane. We get boom, which isn't good, but it is at least plus five bombs. Okay. Pretty happy with how that went. We got a an absolutely metric ton of money out of that, which I'm very happy about. I'd like a heart that I can actually take at some point. That would be very good game, very good indeed. But more bombs is the way. Wow. Okay. Well, we got very lucky this floor. Hey, I, I was actually able to take that heart there. Lovely. We've got a red rune here as well. That was crazy. We've got two of those on one floor. Mulligan, we will take. Mulligan's good stuff. Take double keys here as well. But we've got a red room for creating more locusts if we want to. Okay, I'm, I'm going to lose this burn heart. I know it because I'm, I'm playing particularly quite bad right now. I'm going to try and buy a... Um, what's it called? A heart from the shop and it not be turned into flies. But we'll see if that actually works the way I hope it, hopes it does. We'll see, we'll see. Okay, it does good. I'll buy a soul heart as well, so we've got our ghost form if we need it. And I will pop a bomb right here. We have just enough keys to open this bad boy. Didn't get two items, unfortunately, which is a bit of a shame. We did, however, get a trinket, which I think is very, very good. Right. I think we're going to go back over here. I'm going to use that black heart on the door. Hello, my guy. You're going to be kind of annoying just because of the, yeah, ridiculous radius at which you uh, poop and shit. Luckily, we send you into gold. I said about your poop and shit, man. What I tell you about your poop and shit? Um, GMO con's good. We'll definitely go in here first. Um, I don't really think we have anything in here that's going to be super good for us. I guess I'll just try and steal this with Mr. Me, because why not? Ah, bugger. 
Otherwise, I think, I think I'm okay to leave that. Tinted rocks have a 75% chance to drop a spirit of um, whatever that is. Let's give that a go. That's new. I'll try now. Try out the new things. GMO column for some damage and hopefully range. No, but we do get some speed ups out of that, which is rather nice. And I think we're good to go. Yeah, I think we're good to go. I was hoping this was the floor with the uh, the door to the next the mausoleum, but it wasn't. I was gonna leave some hearts around ready for that, but I didn't think. Okay, so that that's definitely new. Oh, we got a lodestone. Wow. Okay. So this is our, our tinted rock thing. Spirit of D D how do you pronounce that? For eight seconds, Isaac Tears are replaced with a controllable waterfall cyclone that sucks in enemies and pickups. That sounds very intriguing, although we don't have tears, so let's switch over to this guy. Oh my lord, okay, that's fucking awesome. That's so fucking cool. <laughs> For eight seconds as well, man. Okay, so this trinket, dude, another one of these. This, um, this trinket's gonna be real good. Ow. Man, the fucking money, man. Hey, it's Polunka's hat too. <laughs> Electric Boogaloo. We got very lucky. They're quite rare. And we got three of them. Two in one floor was already pretty bizarre. Dude, excuse me. Also, we get so many items from, uh, from these. Thanks for the metal plate, my guy. Thanks for the metal plate. Do not mind it. Oh, I lost a burn heart. I, I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. I think it was GMO Corn that gave us that burn heart. Can't remember. Does GMO Corn give you HP? I think it does. Mama Mega Explosion. I don't think we need that. Hello, Steven. How are you, my good child? Right. Leave those on the floor because they can give us a lot more money. Might as well leave them until we might need them. We're not on 99 money already sort of thing. This guy's a big boy. Quite a big boy. So what... Oh, dude, my god. What I'm curious about is... um, I can't get hit by these, can I? Because I've got thingy spawn because hat. What I'm curious about is that rock that gave us that, that, that thingy. Um, that, that gem. Oh, dude. Lost another burn hat. Did, did that give us that gem because that replaced a tinted rock like my trinket says it does? Or is that just a new type of rock that can show up? I'm unsure. Very annoyed by my current um, situation in terms of the damage I've taken. It's not, uh, not at all ideal. Not at all what I would have hoped for. Bloody hell! My damage. Also, where the hell's our shop? I would like our shop, please. Oh lord, dude! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Evil Eye doesn't do much for us. Take all of that. That does make our swing much bigger, which is nice. Right, straight into the boss fight. Lost another burn heart, baby! Right. Might have to move into my normal mode in a second, into my ghost mode, because clearly fucking this up. I've got golden bombs right now, so I'm just using golden ghost bombs to get everything done. It's working out pretty goddamn well, actually. We get more speed, yay! Right. 
I don't even know if we've seen everything on this floor. Yeah, we've seen the shop and stuff. We see, we've seen everything, I'm pretty sure. Let's just go. Oh, God. Stress. Stressville. Just adding on the the stress. My God. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. I forget. We got mustard seed plus this fella. This is absolutely, unbelievably broken. Yeah, there's another one of those things, look. Yeah, so we're just, we're just gonna have an absolute army now. Like I said, these guys are just unbelievably broken. But yeah, I'm gonna save this eye thing for the boss fight this time, because it was real good last time. Do you want to do your respawny thing? There you go, baby. There you go, do some respawning here as well, maybe. There you go. Do some more in here if you want, my guy. Random smelted trinket, hell yes. Ah, trinket that doesn't do anything for us, sadly. Secret room's back down there. Good old tears down pill, thanks for that. Ah, actually to be fair, this guy could be kind of good. I can't see what's an enemy and what's a friend really, I'll be honest. I have no idea. This guy doesn't even have a health bar. Annihilated him. I like that. It's fun. That is very fun. Right, respawn those fellas for us, why don't you? Boom. Now we have Hat Guy for our very own. How about this fella? Do you want them as well? <laughs> I love how broken this is. Ooh, heal spare also gives us a burn heart. Nice. Right, do we want to get the hell out of here? Maybe we do. Maybe we do. We have a bomb? Oh, I'm feared for some reason. What's fearing me? Soul heart. Burn heart from this, maybe? Nope. Just the trinket we had earlier. My goodness. Right. Down we go. Don't know if we're going to keep this burn heart for long, but we'll try our best. Dude, why am I feared every time I enter a room? Oh, uh, I've got one of those fear skulls as one of my friends. Which, yeah, um... Doesn't work because it fears me still. Uh, also, what's what's going on in this room exactly? Okay, the room's over now, apparently. Okay, I really don't like having the fear guy on our side. That's it's not it's not helping at all. But these guys these guys can can clean up. They can mop up the rooms. It's very hard to focus on when a room's complete. I'll be honest. I'm just assuming most of the time here. Oh, we have multiple of these spawner guys now. We have like four of them. <laughs> oh my... Oh no, no. I can't plant bombs while I'm feared. That's very annoying. I kind of understand why, but... Yeah, it's... It's it's gotten a little bonkers. It always does on this floor. If you have mustard seed, you always have to come to this floor if you can, because it's just so so broken. Room's not over. Okay, it is. Right, boss, bosseth, where art thou? Maybe this way. I don't know.
You respawned everything you want, yep. Respawned them all, lovely. Let me plant a bomb! Oh my god, I can't plant bombs, it's so annoying. I'm immune to stomping attacks, I forgot about that. What the fuck? Like, actually, what the fuck? Um, give, knife, peace. Two? Yeah, there you go. Like, I literally can't even fire and things are dying. Beautiful. Come on, my pretties. Come along. I can't fire! I can't fire my knife! There you go. <laughs> Do you want to bring in those laser eyes for us? Do you want to get a few of those on our side? Seems like a good idea. There you go. There you go. A few laser eyes to help us out. Down we go. It's going to only end in, in success. This is beautiful. I'm liking heal spare as well here to help us out. Oh, more money? Lovely. It's exactly what I needed. Right, I think this is Beeline Street. Just, just, just try and get there. Bomb. Yeah, yeah, I planted a bomb. Feel so proud of myself being able to plant just a, a wee little bomb. We got an angel disc there that I'll carry with me for the boss fight, I think. Not really used Mr. Me all that much, have we? It's fine. He exists to serve me, it's fine. You all good? No? Yes? The door's open yet? Yes, they are. I, I'm, I'm not even allowed to, I'm not even allowed to like take part in these rooms right now. The game's just like, nah, this is not your time to shine. We have this covered. You just kick back, just relax. Don't worry about it. Dude, this little skull, okay, I might have touched it. Where am I? I barely know where I am. I have a very, very loose grasp on what's happening most of the time. I, I know that I got hit. That's about all I know. Okay. These guys teleport to the other side of the room straight away, which is kind of good. Bring any of these back to life, my guys. Okay, I got hit again. There's something alive in here. I don't know what. Tis the boss. Tis the season. Okay, I've got to switch back to my ghost guy because I got hit again and I don't really know how or why. Okay. You're basically dead, my guy. Stay away from me. Okay, now he's dying very slowly. Barso, thank you. To the next floor. Okay, now we've just got to navigate this mess once again. We're in permanent ghost form at this point because we can't really do anything else. There's a lot of poison about and I don't know if it's mine. I'm going to assume it's not, but... Who could really know? Okay, so not this way. <laughs> My god. <laughs> Look at all the purple dudes. Stay away from me. I don't know what's real. I don't know what's real anymore. I'm not allowed to fire or take part in any of this. It just kind of is what it is. Okay, um... I apparently died to something. I don't know what. 
That was hectic, but a nice little look, a little first look at Milkshake. We didn't see too many items from it, but we saw a good few. Um, and I'm looking forward to seeing more, so I'll keep this mod on from now on. And yeah, we'll see what we can find with it. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.